athletes had come from all over the country to run for the gold or the silver or bronze. Many of the weeks and months of their training all coming down to these games. The spectators gathered around the old field for cheering on all these young women and men. And the final event of the day was approaching. Excitement grew high to begin. The blocks were all lined up for those who would use them. The hundred yard dash was the race to be run. There were nine resolved athletes in back of the starting line, poised for the sound of the gun. At the signal was given, the pistol exploded. So did the runners, all charging. The smallest among them, he stumbled and staggered fell to the asphalt instead. He gave up crying in frustration and anguish. His dreams and his efforts all dashed in the dirt. But as sure as I'm standing here telling the story, the same goes for what next occurred. The eight other runners pulled up on their heels. The ones who had trained for so long to compete. One by one they all turned round and they went back to help him. They brought that young boy to his feet. Then all the nine runners joined hands and continued. The hundred yard dash now reduced to a walk. could not have been more of the mark. For that's how the race ended, with nine gold medals. They came to the finish line, holding hands still. And a standing ovation, and nine new faces, said more than these words ever will. That's how the race ended, Nine gold medals, they came to the finish line, holding hands still. And a banner above that said special Olympics, said more than these words and will. So much more than these words ever will.